How to download Valorant on PC for free is the topic of today's video. If you're new to the True Tool Tucker channel, please go down below and hit the subscribe button right now. I really do appreciate it. And then go and leave a like. It does mean a lot and it just means if you get more people. So today I'm going with a full guide of being able to access Valorant on your computer and play it from downloading it to installing it to then getting ready. And yeah, I've got a bit of tips at the end as well. Um, just any sort of troubleshooting issues you may have. And I hope you do find this useful. And without any further ado, let's jump straight into this. I'm now in the tutorial part of the how to download Valorant on PC and laptop and pretty much any device. So the first thing we're going to do is simply just search up Riot Games. So quickly, I want to quickly cover, essentially you can't just get Valorant on, you know, games on systems like Steam um, and other sort of game um, shops and, you know, game stores. You have to actually download a specific installer for this um, because they are the developers of the game. It's not like they've uploaded it onto Steam. So yeah, what we're going to do is come to Riot Games home and we can hop into here. And as you can see, Riot Games do loads of games. We've got Valorant here, but you've obviously got League of Legends and a couple of others. So here's Valorant. All you do is come and click on it, click here. And now it's going to take you to the Valorant site. So we are now here. So the first thing you want to do is click on play now, of course, because we want to play it, get it on our computers. So click there. Now, as you can see here, you've got two options. I don't have a Riot account yet. I have a Riot account. So I don't have one, so I'm going to click make now. But if you have one, you click here and come and sign in. Um, as you can see, just go and sign in. So I'm going to come back and actually go and register. And I'm going to click make one. I'll quickly run through this right now. So the first thing you want to do is enter your email. So I'll type that in quickly now. And then we can go to the next step. So then you've got the option here to receive occasional news. Personally, I'm not going to. Um, but if you want, you can tick it there. Then you want to enter your date of birth, so I'll enter that now, and we'll get to the next one. And then you choose your username. So for me, I'm going to use Tutorial Tucker as that is my uh, username. Then click next, and here you got to enter your password. So make sure it's something secure and something you're going to remember. So I'll do that now. And once you've done that, it's now going to load, and you should have successfully created your account. And you'll be on this page here where you can go and download Valorant. Make sure you keep watching. So you want to can click here and click download. And you've got this option here, so you've got to go and verify your date of birth. And once you've done that, you can then go and click download to download Valorant. So I'm going to click download. And as you can see, we've now got this installer down here. Now, this is only 65 megabytes. This isn't the whole game, of course, because otherwise that would just be way too small. So as you can see, it's downloading. It's almost there. I'll quickly wait. And now we're done. So then I'm going to go and click on it. You're probably going to get a window security pop up in a minute. Yep, there we go. Sorry, making my screen recorder blocks that out, so uh, I can't show you that, but it's simply something where you click yes or no. Anyway, we've now got this here. As you can see, Riot Games, we've got the options here to click install. 8.6 gigabytes, but quickly, if you click on the advanced options here, you can go and change the install path. So personally, I'm going to, and I've just changed that now, and I'm now going to click install. So as you can see, it's now installing, it's preparing, and it's just doing this. So you essentially going to wait, this will take a while, um, there's a few steps you have to complete but it's all pretty straightforward from now on. Like I said before, I am going to show you the quick troubleshooting thing at the end as well if you have an issue with being able to access Valorant, but I'll quickly show you this. There's a few sort of different um, softwares and bits of files it has to install, so you just got to sort of wait it out and it gives you a little timer down here, which is pretty easy to use. Um, as you can see, it's now finished and it's actually disappeared, um, but it will probably, something else is going to appear in a minute. So as you can see, you've now got to go and sign in. So I'm going to quickly sign in and then I'll be back. So I've now entered my details, I'm going to click sign in. And as you can see, actually, it's already downloading here. It's done about 150 meg so far. So I'm going to quickly read through these and then go and accept them. So I've now read through them and now I'm going to click accept and we're now here. So as you can see, new player and I'm currently downloading it and it's going to take 11 minutes and then once it's finished you can go and get Valorant. Now this is so so easy and it's absolutely insane and I just think it's so so good and yeah it's really really awesome. You just have to wait for this and if you've got slow internet I'll give you a few tips in a minute as well but yeah let's jump into the troubleshooting part of the video. So here is some gameplay my brother actually recorded of Valorant. It's super, super good and really fun. I played it on his PC simply because while I'm recording this, mine was still downloading. Um, as you did see, it's quite a big download. And I want to quickly cover some tips of 
in, in basically increasing your download speed. So a few tips of increasing your download speed to be able to access these games faster is basically the first tip is not going on your PC while the download is occurring essentially because anything else on your computer like going on Chrome, going on any other web browser will decrease the download speed which will just make it even longer to go and download which will just take it longer to access the game right. Another tip is I would recommend doing it overnight. It speeds the whole process up a lot and you'll see you have those like eight hours while you're asleep or however long you're asleep um, to, for the game to download in no matter what the speed of your internet is they're like the main tips but yeah I thought at least this gameplay playing I hope you do enjoy just sort of watching through the gameplay getting an idea of what it is like essentially as I know a lot of people you know when they have slow internet or even if they don't even know what internet they have it's nice to be able to see what the game is like before downloading it because it may not be to your style um, so yeah I hope you do enjoy this bit of gameplay I'll just have it running for a few more minutes and then you can go and download it yourself or basically I won't put link down below but you can see where it is and I did describe how to get to it on Google so that won't take two minutes but if there's any other more how to's you want to see on the channel please do let me know I really do like making content which you actually enjoy seeing and uh, yeah I think that's the main tips I wanted to cover if you want to see any other specific downloads as well I think is the main thing I want to say you know there's obviously how to's but you can go and be able to go and download specific games and do keep watching the whole channel I'm making so many how to's daily content is coming other tutorials mainly more TikTok based very very soon so do keep watching but quickly a huge thank you for 18,000 subscribers we hit it just a couple of days ago and the channel is growing so so fast I appreciate it so much the channel's doing absolute bits and I obviously this channel wouldn't be here without you guys watching and I do appreciate that a lot and if you're still here drop a like right now and subscribe and there's a lot more content coming so make sure you turn that notification bell on so you're notified every time I drop a brand new video but if you're excited for the next one make sure you comment that below as well and if there's any other issues you run in any other questions you have drop them below and I'll try my best to reply to them and often actually people in the comments as well will end up replying to you as well um, you know replying and saying if there's something they can do or something they've encountered and managed to troubleshoot but if you have any sort of like more like specific stuff I do always recommend putting like an error code into Google that does help a lot and you can essentially Google that error code and it will list of you can maybe a few forums or the actual developers site where they've come across this issue and a, and a fix for it um, otherwise you know doing it yourself can take a while and I'll try my best to reply to the comments but obviously you know the more videos I upload the harder it is to get to reply to comments I'm trying to reply to as many as possible especially more like question specific um, comments you know if they have a specific question which I know I can give a good answer to I will be definitely trying to reply to that um, but yeah there's a lot of comments coming in which I do really appreciate I appreciate all the support so so much so please do keep it up the channel is growing so well and I appreciate it and yeah I think that's the main topics I wanted to cover but anyways thank you so much for watching this insane Valorant video if you're interested in more content just like this consider subscribing down below right now and I look forward to catch you in the next one have an awesome day peace